plant photosynthesis is using the sun as a kind of engine to form an organic substance which in the form of wood was man's original energy source. This substance is biomass that since our prehistoric times has given the inhabitants of Earth energy to light, heat and cooking. Biomass such as wood has been used for energy purposes ever since mankind learned to control fire. And biomass is renewable because we can always grow more. Among the renewable energy sources, wind and biomass are the two with the most potential. All of the other renewable technologies to date are intermittent. They follow their resources. Wind will be intermittent, solar will be intermittent, hydro will be int intermittent. This is a, a nice baseload technology uh, which can be relied on, upon sort of very much. Um, the one thing you cannot do with the wind is to guarantee that it will be there when you need it. The same capacity biomass can produce three times the energy of the same capacity wind farm. Biomass can be converted into electricity and heat. Compared to the fossil fuel sources, it can be much more evenly distributed. Over the last 10 years, more than 100 biomass-fired power plants with high efficiency and reliability have been built in Europe. The city of Linz has 200,000 inhabitants and we were always uh, trying to find the energy system for the diversification of the fuel. Our main source for the biomass plant is untreated wood. So behind me you can see the control room where the plant is operated. The plant design is made for a full automatic operation of the power plant. Total production of district heating from this plant is about 200 gigawatt hours and we are producing more than 65 gigawatt hours of electricity. The collaboration with IIT uh, was very good. IIT had won uh, the contract against uh, another uh, plant manufacturers or designers in Europe. It was a very professional uh, project management and uh, engineering was done in Denmark by IIT. The Gittersle plant has an annual input of approximately 120,000 tons of wood chips, wood waste, demolition wood, bark, saw and sander dust. AET was a turnkey supplier of the fuel handling, the boiler plant and the Flugas cleaning system. We verwenden the biomass from Altholz zur Verbrennung in unserer KWK und wir nutzen sie in zwei Hinsichten, einmal in einer Hochdruckstufe zur Erzeugung vom Strom und einmal in einer Niederdruckstufe zur Erzeugung von Dampf, um unsere Spantrockner zu betreiben. Die Zusammenarbeit zwischen AET und Fleiderer läuft sehr positiv. Gütersloh ist ja bereits die dritte Anlage, die Fleiderer gemeinsam mit AET aufgebaut hat. Und auch heute, nach sieben Jahren, nachdem die KWK hier in Gütersloh in Betrieb genommen ist, haben wir eine sehr regelmäßige Zusammenarbeit mit AET und einen ständigen Austausch. Und AET ist auch häufig hier bei uns und macht mit uns Verbesserungen, die insbesondere auf die Erhöhung der Verfügbarkeit oder die Reduzierung der Reparaturkosten abzielt. AET has since 1997 been experiencing a steady growth. The company has great references and a good reputation among its customers. The reason for the success is the exploitation of the unique capabilities that exist in the company. The foundation of our company is really the experience and competence that each person in the organization possesses. Uh, a lot of people in the company have worked with this type of plants for 10, 15 years or more and their experience is simply invaluable. This plant, which is now fully operational, is the first commercial scale biomass renewable energy power station in Wales. The wood combustion plant, sited in Margam, Port Talbot, generates enough energy which is sufficient to meet the needs of 31,000 homes. This is the first dedicated biomass plant in Wales. The only other project is a coal fired power station that's taking in a proportion of wood to mix in with coal under what's known as coal firing. But this project will take 100% wood as fuel. The operational team should be a core of about 17 people. 
Um, the, the maintenance actually will be done by the builders as well. Uh, we've actually been lucky enough to secure not just a construction contract with them, but a maintenance contract with them. And that really helps because what you can get with biomass projects or any form of project actually is if you get a fault shortly after you finish completion of building, the operator will, build, will blame the builder and the builder will blame the operator. And it actually removes any of the interface problems. All the way through a project, we try to keep in close contact with our client in order to help him get the best possible plan to the, as the end result. Quite often in the course of a project, some conditions will change and this may require finding new solutions, short notice, and a close relationship with a client that's built on trust and openness and honesty usually makes it easier to make the necessary decisions. The use of biomass as an energy source is perhaps the most mature technology used by man, beginning with the controlled use of fire. And there remains a big market for biomass-fired power plants in Europe.